An attack on a Ukrainian National Guard base turns bloody. Three people were killed in the eastern city of Maripol, making it the bloodiest day in the region's 10-day uprising. There, a group of masked men tried to take over a military unit. One masked man said they had called on Ukrainian forces for peaceful talks. You need to understand the most important thing. They not only refused to talk to us, the soldiers didn't even spare a word. They first stood across the area and nobody would talk to us. We had a feeling that these people weren't Maripol residents. We called on them empty-handed for talks, asked them to pass the request over to their boss. We said we didn't want to shoot, not a single shot, but they shot into the air. In the morning, investigators gathered evidence of the bloodshed. Bullet casing sat empty near a gray Ukrainian police vehicle. They wanted to storm our base but only managed one step. A car was pushed aside from our side. We fired the first shot in the air. It was a warning shot. Ukraine's acting president, Alexander Turchinov, said 13 were injured and 64 were arrested in the violence. The city's administration was seized over the weekend by separatists.